In this video, we will guide you through the setup process of your Discrete 4. After you have downloaded and installed the Antelope Audio driver, created an Antelope Audio user account, and downloaded the launcher, start the Antelope Audio launcher and click on the discrete icon to launch its control panel. The discrete's panel is simple and elegant. It will take no time to get to know the signal flow. On the very top of the panel, you can see the clock source, sample rate, and session controls, including the save and load functions. Next we have the preamp section. Here you can control each of the four preamps. Available settings include channel link, channel mode, which can be preamp in, line in or instrument in, and preamp gain and phantom power. On the following tabs you can select what is displayed on the main routing and mixing screen. Featured controls include monitor and headphone outs, digital and analog outs, and DAW control. Select what you want to route to each individual output from the drop-down menus. On the DAW option, FROM indicates the computer playback or output channels coming from your DAW for playback. And the TO section indicates the USB or Thunderbolt input or recording channels going to your DAW for recording. Note that by default, computer play channels 1 and 2 are your main master DAW outputs. Then we have the AFX section. Click here to access the AFX available for each of these channels plus their settings. Save, load, bypass and delete. By default, the AFX are only available on the very first two channels of the Discrete 4. After activating the premium upgrade pack, the AFX can be available on the first four channels. Then we have the mixers section for each set of outputs, headphones 1 and monitors, and headphones 2 to 4. You can select between an 8 channel or a 16 channel mixer and access controls for each channel solo, mute, link, pan and volume, plus a master dim, master mute and master volume control. From here you can create individual mixers for each of the discrete monitor or headphone outputs. Please note that the sources for each of the mixers will be the same Therefore, you cannot select different sources for a different mix. At the top right corner is the settings section. Here you can adjust features including trim levels, tone oscillator settings, as well as buffer and latency controls. Press the info button to access the information about your device, alongside the administration panel, from where you can assign or unassign your device and access features such as your premium upgrade pack. If you need any help with your device, check out the tech support feature, which takes you to the support section of our website. Now you're good to go.